You know, I've never noticed that thing falling. Is that important? Maybe we'll find out. I would like a marshmallow though. Ah, no! Man. No. Okay. One more time. Do all these people eat as marshmallows? Okay, I think that's good. Good crunch. Okay, obviously they don't. That is some kind of soup. Some kind of salad. That's delicious to you. Ugh, nothing better than like a good crunchy marshmallow. Okay. Last time. We'll suit up. Oh. Right, that's how we look at the map. We are there. That is the sun. That is giant sea. Okay. Uh. Is that always glow in purple like that? Okay, so we found some more stuff. Uh. We still got a lot of stuff to look for. Uh. Now I built a shrine on Quantum Moon to aid in the pilgrimage to its sixth location. Uh, many Nomai went on a pilgrimage during which the Quantum Moon carried them to its sixth and most secret location. To explore the sixth location, the shrine on the Quantum Moon must be on the moon's north pole. I'm from somewhere on the Hourglass Twins. There's so much to do. Uh, the negative time interval measured at the White Hole Station was further investigated at the High Energy Lab. Uh, the central chamber inside Ashton is blah, blah. I feel like I don't have time. I don't have time! Uh. Okay. Uh, we are just gonna go to, uh, wrong thing. Also, we have to, like, kind of relearn the controls. Maybe we'll go to Giant Steep? Why not? Uh. I'm very happy that it keeps the controls on screen at all times. I guess so lost. Uh, obviously we don't want to go to the sun. Maybe we'll go there. If we go, if we're flying into the sun, I'm very sorry. I don't mean to do that. Uh, unless, can we land here? No. Oh, okay, we're fine. We're good. Maybe we did get too close to the sun. Yeah, I think we did. <laughs> okay, not off to a great start, but that's fine. It's okay. Yeah, we're fine. 
We'll, uh, we'll, we'll eat a marshmallow and then we'll be good to go. Delicious. It did say something about Ember Twins, so we have to be able to go there, right? I think we honestly got just too close to the sun. Oh, maybe it was Hourglass Twins. No, see, it does say something. Maybe we'll try again and like try to go like around the sun. got all three okay definitely something here Okay, we landed. Uh, unbuckle. Alrighty. See. Uh. We gravity. Landed way too far away. Oh no, there we are. That's the thing I wanted to go see. We. Interesting. Oh, there's like stairs. Oh, aha. Uh, the Sunless City. Note the store will need to remain closed for some time. Pi and I are running an experiment based on the extraordinary findings from the White Hole Station. An update, the high energy lab is now being used to design the Ash Twin project. If you're here to help or just to observe, be sure to use the Sunless City path to the lab. Uh, Rami and I will be running this experiment until one of us, specifically me, can prove the other wrong. So although it's inconvenient, the lab can only be accessed from the path of the Sunless City. Okay, obviously we can't go in here. Oh. This one? I hope this is correct. I'm going to assume we follow this. That looks like something. This also looks like things. Ghost matter! Fuck. Sunless city. <gasps> That's ghost matter, isn't it? Crash site cave. Uh, can I, like...
That was fair. I thought I could outsmart the ghost. <laughs> Obviously, you cannot. So we have to go. We have to get inside some other way. Or is there a way to? <gasps> We're okay. Can I talk to the ghost. Be like, hey, ghost. We're best. Oh. Ugh. It's fine. A burnt one never hurt anybody. <laughs> okay. We get an update it's on the city. Hello. Try to head back there. Nice. I think this is another one of those things that I can't... Oh, 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 oh. Well, okay. We just exploring Tower Shard. status reports for all systems with initial things versus everyone unharmed. Our escape pods passengers are afraid, but physically well. Anona, everyone survived the crash. That's a relief, at least. You have my gratitude. Or were you able to find the other escape pods distress signals? I can hear both signals somewhere in this star system, but I don't believe either escape pod crashed on the same planet as us. Okay, I remember last time I was in one of these, I got kind of scared because I, oh yeah, this thing scared me. Okay. Scan external environment, scan complete, external temperature is prohibitively high, verdict inhospitable, do not seek shelter on planet's surface. Collision imminent, preparing for impact. Launch escape pod three, now launch escape pod two. Begin flight log. These are read from top down, not down top. Either way. Okay, escape pod 2 vessel has been morally injured. Emergency sequence activated, awaiting departure from vessel. The heat from the star system sun is more bearable below the surface. When our escape pod punctured this planet's surface, it broke into what scans show as a cave system with much cooler air. I would recommend we seek a site down there to build a long-term shelter in Anona, but these passages are a maze. Oh god. Even with this danger, they are still our best chance for survival. We'll form teams and descend into the caves to look for a shelter site. We can mark our findings on the walls to avoid becoming irreversibly lost. Cautious, everyone. Be aware of the sands as you surge. It appears to be rising gradually. Okay. <gasps> it's like, why is it so dark? Escape. Keep moving 
friends or something of interest at the end of this passage about rocks. And while these rocks are interesting, they can wait until a less urgent time. Do not follow the snow to the end. Oh. Okay. Spooky. We have found an enormous cavern at the end of this passage that appears promising. I believe we could construct long-term shelter here. The cavern Mellorey found is a wise choice for shelter. Could one of you mark directions for the others to follow? This is the start of the path to the shelter. I've left directions to guide you there. Of note, we must hurry as the pathway there is filling with sand. Do not allow yourself to be buried by sand which no one is lost. But what does that one over there say? Oh, this is... Oh, I'm scared. Oh. oh. I can't get up. Here we go. <laughs> the past of the shelter site is somewhat convoluted, so follow the instructions ahead closely. To reach shelter site, walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left. Continue to the room filled with rock column formations and climb upward through the opening above them. Oh god. Sand here is rising, so you must be cautious and swift. Let me read that one more time. Walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left. Continue to the room filled with the rock column formations and climb upward through the opening above them. Okay, so forward, left, and essentially forward. Do these go the same way? They must. Okay. I don't like this. Huh? Or, oh, oh, left. put more marks on the wall they said up right oh god there's no trees oh gosh is crossing the chasm ahead the bridge board and I will do its job but it isn't strong Once on the far side, look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sand. Follow and you'll reach the shelter site. Huh? Oh, there we go. Okay. You're doing well, there's only a little further left to go until you reach the shelter site. You can rest there, hurry before the sand comes. Or before I run out of oxygen! I feel like I gotta go up. Please. Okay. Okay. <gasps> Trees! Where fish also live. Need oxygen. Oh, thank God. Do 
we build the sun station to power the ash twin project are there other ways to generate this level of power i understand this proposal is unsettling but the sun station must be built if we hope to complete the ash twin project theoretically yes practically no i can't imagine discovering them in our life I almost can't comprehend this as being suggested seriously. The purpose of the sun station goes against every standard we hold ourselves to and everything we believe in as a species. Unsurprisingly, I, di I, di I disagree. We're pushing a, new tech a possible new technology further than ever before. That, in my experience, is the defining characteristic of our species. If we fail and the probability of this is not insignificant, we will without question destroy ourselves, all life here, and the rest of this star system. I wish to protect these species. What are they doing? The potential annihilation of an entire star system is too severe a cost. We shouldn't build the sun station, no matter how badly we want the knowledge that comes with it. Fear of failure is a poor reason not to try. Ah, I don't know. <laughs> I believe if we are cautious, the sun station will work. I believe in pie. Poke, I'm deeply honored. Idea, I comprehend your position. However, if we aren't all but certain the sensation will not cause destruction, once we've built it, I won't support the station's use. What were they built? Anglerfish Overlook District. Stepping Stone District. High Energy Lab Trailhead, I Shrine District. Oh! Oh! Is this like an elevator? So is this one again? Anglerfish, Stepping Stone. I feel like it may be here. Stepping stone cave. I don't like this. I want to go back. Oh, for a minute I was like, can I not go back? I don't know if I'm ready to go in there. Maybe if I, uh... <laughs> and this was the stepping stone. Yeah, maybe if we do this. Oh, whoa! Okay. Obviously, ghosts, so no. Oh no! Shoot, I didn't mean to knock it over. I'm sorry. Thank you for fixing yourself. Maybe we'll go to the fossils? Ooh. 
This is amazing. Look inside the cave. How did this come to rest here? We haven't encountered others in these caves. I think this is a rare find. From what we can see, Colossus and I believe this specimen must be very old indeed. Imagine what we might learn so we could examine it. An update. We need to find a way inside quickly, Malore, because when I returned here to search for an entrance to the cave, there were children playing on the specimen. We both agree it's unlikely this dry planet is this horror's place of origin. I'm... Oh my god. Especially considering what we've observed during the vessel's evacuation. Clearly this hole is too small for it to have fit through. Hypothesis, there is another entrance to this cave. If there is, Colossus and I will find it. We can't leave valuable information undiscovered. Okay. Okay, obviously we can't fit through there. That is fine. Interesting though. There was something in there. I just couldn't see it. Spooky. <gasps> oh shit. Oh shit, the sand is rising. Oh. Gravity cannon. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <gasps> Don't drown. It's too late. That was kind of scary. What a crunch indeed. Oh, I didn't like that. Okay. Damn, there's a <gasps> lot. There's a lot to see in there. Oh. My autopilot threw my ship directly into the sun. Oops. Keep getting killed by ghost matter. Not if you use your scout to detect it. You won't. You dumb idiot. Did you think I made that just so you take pretty pictures of trees? I don't know. You do know you could use the light source, right? Stars above you tell me you knew that. Yes. Oh, do the ghosts not like light? Oh. Speaking of crunch, this is a better crunch. Uh, my autopilot. <laughs> ah, 
Okay, yeah. Don't, don't fly too close to the sun. One of three no my escape pods that crash in our solar system. All three escape pods launched from something called the vessel, which was damaged. Oh yeah, the fossil. I know there's more to explore here. I got stuck in the sand. Uh No my city built into the built into the walls of the huge cavern, our underground cavern, the city's divided vertically into four districts. The Nomai debated building a sun station in order to power the Ashram project. Several Nomai opposed this construction, arguing that the failure could result in the destruction of the solar system. Okay. It is Outer Wilds time. Welcome. Uh, you didn't miss much. We died like three times being silly. Uh, but we discovered the Sunless City. And then I got crunched by the sand. So, yeah, flying in the sun, drowning in the sand. We did one other thing, I feel. Um, so, I want to go back. To look more at the sunless city. That's that's where my fixation is currently at. Since there's a lot to explore there and not a lot of time. sand is really stressful. I didn't realize it at first. Like, you know, they're like, oh, the sand. But nothing was happening until it was essentially too late, and then I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> but it's fine. Oh, uh, we also found the second escape pod. was broken. Oh. There we go. Okay, that seems fine. Oh, uh, we learned that I can use my little scout launcher to um, avoid the ghosts. So that's kind of cool, I think. At least that's what our friend said. He called us an idiot. Didn't appreciate that. That's the other thing we died to. <laughs> Yeah, he goes mad. <laughs> yeah, he's like, you didn't know about this? No, no one. I mean, maybe that was like tutorial, but oh shit! Not 
not quite the toilet. Oh, this looks fancy. Okay. We're somewhere. It's it's handy no yeah, I'm really glad I know it now. I haven't run into that much ghost matter, so it's fine. Okay, cool. Found this on the city. Sick. Okay. What is this though? The shuttle's currently resetting at the comet. Uh-huh. Call the shuttle home. I have to make the Way gravity cannon! Isn't that something? Can I call the shuttle home? That sounds familiar. Fancy ship. <gasps> the Earth situation might be dire. Hi, Poke and I landed here on this comet not long after its arrival in the star system. Our shuttle's equipment heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Hi and Poke were able to locate a fissure in the ice and the comet's sunward side, and they descended inside to investigate the source of their readings. But, Pi and my sister have been gone for a long time now. They haven't contacted me since descending below the surface either. Oh no, should I leave the shuttle to look for them? I want to follow protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if they aren't well. Poke, Pi, come back to me safely, my friends. Oh no! This, I'm always like, what do things do? And then I'm scared it's gonna do something like bad. <gasps> we gonna burn up again? We're flying really close to the sun. Okay. That's fair. But I feel like that shuttle something. I mean, I know everything is something. Also, that thing being shot out. What is that? There's so much I want to... I get lost so easy. I'm like, oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? But first, there's always... We have to make a marshmallow. Ugh. It's fine. Got anything new for me? No. So, yeah. Just the ghost matter. A huge cylindrical structure that generates strong upward gravity fields. There's more to explore! Oh my god, okay. The Nomai landed on the interloper not long after its arrival in the solar system. The shuttle's equipment heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Larry, the Nomai stayed behind, lost contact with the other two after this. So we have to go back on the ship. Back to the ship. 